Hello everyone, my name is Albert and welcome back to our Mojito Studios video and in this video I'm going to show you how to export SketchUp files or SketchUp objects or whatever you do in SketchUp to MMD. So what is SketchUp some of you ask? Well SketchUp is a program that allows you to do some stages and also some props but if you want to do detailed props Blender is the way to go because SketchUp is not extremely detailed and yeah how to do that? Well, you're gonna need this little plugin that, of course, I'm gonna leave in the description below, and that, of course, is not mine. I did not make this. So, what you wanna do after you download it, you don't wanna just simply extract it, and you're gonna get those two. So, right now, you wanna press Win R and type like this percent up data percent and you're going to be greeted with something like this so what you want to do right now is going to go to sketchup sketchup 2017 you see and sketchup plugins and yeah my battery is fading but let's leave that away so you're going to be greeted with all of those if you haven't installed any plugins so what you want to do is going to copy or cut it and simply bang paste it after you're done with this just Go SketchUp. Let's wait for it to open. Uh, this thing, start using. And uh, I'll quickly model something, but because my memory is fading, I need to be very fast and it's not gonna be that good. Ignore this. Ignore this. Done. I modeled it. It's a box. What, did you expect me to make something incredible? Well, I'm still not that good at this, but still I'm pretty good. But anyway, so after you model your thing, you can do way more stuff. You can go in the 3D warehouse. I'm gonna look in a link in the description down below to the 3D warehouse where you can find a bunch of props or simply benches, houses, mansions, castles, literally what you can think. I saw even cars. Yes, cars. And you can simply go and download them and make them for MD or yeah, you get it. So after you've done your thing, click on ex extensions and the accessory this thing and you wanna browse your thing. Here's the thing or here is something uh, when you also have textures like you put textured not colors just textures or you just do this well you might want to make a folder because this thing puts all the textures and the file the .x file into that folder so let's say if I'm gonna put it on my desktop, you're gonna have all the textures on your desktop, which kind of sucks. So right now, because I don't have any textures, I'm gonna name, name this like box. And there we go. Export. It was so fast because there are there's not that much big of a deal complicated model. So we can close. Uh, no, thank you. And here now you just can open MD and load desktop or wherever you put your thing and uh, let me background black 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 background <laughs> and yeah you got a box so yeah you can do a lot more stuff with SketchUp but I'm not the one that's going to teach you this because there are plenty of tutorials on SketchUp on YouTube and on the whole internet like if you have problem with this plugin, I can help you out with SketchUp. Not yet, not yet, because I'm no master at this. Like I've made a few stages myself, but still, I'm not that good. So anyway, I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, smash the like button. And of course, if you wanna make me happy, wanna press the subscribe button. Who knows? Maybe when I post the 
the anniversary and thing video because the channel anniversary I don't know if I said this but the channel anniversary is very close the 17th of September yes the 17th and it's like a few days closed uh, sluggish laptop open <laughs> so yeah there's a weekend a bit till I uh, yeah till I celebrate my anniversary of one year of YouTube. Anyway, so yeah, goodbye!